Thousands of thoroughbred racehorses leave American racetracks every year, 2,000 in California alone. Most are young and able to have great and useful lives after racing, if we give them the protection, time, and attention they deserve. TROT, which stands for Training Racehorses Off the Track, is a registered 501c3 nonprofit, and we have as our mission to give these racehorses a great life after racing through a monitored adoption program. We are an all-volunteer organization, and every dollar raised is for the benefit of the horses. Horse racing might be synonymous with luxury and the good life, but for the horses, many face uncertain futures when they can no longer compete. Our animal advocate, Jill Rappaport, found one organization working to place these animals into homes that fit their needs. It's known as the sport of kings, but beneath the tradition, the glamour, and the thrill of horse racing lies a disturbing question. What happens to all the four-legged athletes who can't make it all the way to the winner's circle? It's a huge problem to find homes for horses. If you just want to close your eyes and pretend you don't know where they went, that's a solution, but it's not a solution for me. Trainers like Vladimir Soren know the sad truth. Many of these beautiful animals end up with owners who do not know how to care for them, or worse. One of the biggest nightmares that I have is that a horse that I gave away as a pleasure horse to someone, that person couldn't afford to keep them after a while, and they send them to the killers. That's where Bonnie Adams comes in. Her nonprofit organization, Trot, works with trainers like Soren to find new homes for horses whose racing careers are over. When I found out that there was a problem that when horses leave the racetrack, so many of them had no place to go, I just felt I had to do something. Adams has brought these horses from the high stakes, high pressure environment of the track to the peace and quiet of sunny San Marcos, California. Looks like horsey heaven, but they're not just here on vacation. Trot partners with expert handlers like Hannah Moritzson at Sweet Equine in order to retrain these former racers for second careers. They can be a dressage horse, or they can be a jumper, or just a pleasure horse. You know, I think all horses want a job. I can see from my experience they are a lot happier. If you have a horse just standing in the stall, you can see they develop bad habits. They're not happy. So it's very interesting because when people think about racehorses, the last thing I think that would come to most people's minds is, wow, I can just get on a racehorse and mosey on down the road. That's right. But yet you're training them for, you know, to be really wonderful riding horses for people of all ages. That's right. They're so versatile. The thoroughbred is a very versatile breed. And once they've adjusted to life off the track, Adams makes sure that every horse is adopted into the right family. These two energetic mares ended up here in Arizona. It's okay. Where veterinarian and polo enthusiast Diego Flores is hoping they'll succeed in a completely new sport. We look to rescue animals in my clinic and she is definitely the right fit for us here. They haven't even hit their prime yet. So we believe by giving them some training, we give them a value that stays with them forever. For sequel and secret, a fresh start. And for Adams, the warm feeling that comes with helping horses enjoy productive lives, long after the cheers from the grandstand have faded away. Now, thanks to groups like Trot, a second chance for a second life is possible. But as you guys know, as a nonprofit, it's a very costly endeavor, but so worth it when you see their next chapter. Beautiful and horses. they're discarded at an age when they're babies, babies. basically. Babies, right. yeah. and, and they can Toddlers. have so many wonderful careers, as you can see, in so many different areas. Our facilities we use to rest, rehabilitate, and retrain include the beautiful Stone Pine Resort in Carmel Valley, California. Horses that are ready for the retraining stage get to be ridden and cared for by our dedicated volunteers. We also have a layup facility in Hemet, California. Here they get to be just horses and restore body and spirit. We all know about Zenyatta, and Team Zenyatta has been very supportive of Trot and its mission. She even made Oprah's power list. But not all horses can be as fortunate or as talented as Zinyana. 
and they all deserve our respect and attention. We at the Dobrid Racetrack Industry really appreciate what Trot does to retired race horses. Trot makes a difference. Thank you, Trot. Trot makes a difference. Trot makes a difference. Thanks again for all you do. Trot makes a difference. Trot's making a difference. Trot makes the difference. Hey, Trot makes a difference. A big difference. Hey. Trot makes a real difference. So let's keep them going and keep the horses taken care of. While Trot has great support from the Teddy Cole Foundation, we cannot fully accomplish our mission without your support. Please consider being a benefactor so we can be a safety net for those racehorses. You can donate at trotusa.org and make a difference. And if you are considering getting a horse, please consider one of Trot's.